Pan right now who's out in the newsroom for the first.com check though. Thanks Lauren. I, I, it's a great photo and I hope this year at the Corporate Challenge everyone remembers to send in their reported pictures so we can use them on air and of course online. You know this morning we have a lot going on so I want to take you to our News 4 website WIVB.com where you'll see if you got, have our News 4 app or follow us on Facebook or Twitter. You got an alert today about the traffic in Western New York. There's a few different instance, uh, incidents that are going on. There was actually a vehicle fire on the uh, I-90 East earlier. It's almost cleared up now, but it's still backed up from Ridge Road to the 190. So you'll see that we've been updating all of the traffic information for you online as you head out the door, whether you're going to school or work this morning. And, you know, Alicia is actually at a different uh, incident that's happening around Western New York today. This is on Tonawanda Creek Road in Clarence, where there is a situation that closed the road for about a half a mile because of a soil erosion. So crews are on the scene fixing that right now. And again, you can find all those details on WIVB.com. And since we're talking about what's happening today, I don't. I also want to show you a story that we are doing about the Special Olympics. The torch will be coming through Western New York. And we are learning more about the Special Olympics tomorrow on our show. So I wanted to get you started with this story that's on WIVB.com. And if you want to learn more about the Special Olympics that are kicking off this weekend, you can go to this story and, of course, find a link to learn more about it right from there. So lots happening today. Now it's time to send it back out to the studio. Maybe some great looks to take up with you to Toronto this summer if you're making a trip to Toronto. And earlier on the show, we were learning about what's happening in Toronto and how you can learn more about it. So I wanted to show you a great website to go to to learn more about tourism in Toronto. Their website is mytorontomeeting.com and on this website you'll see you can learn everything you want to know when taking a trip. I know I've actually used this website before when heading there for a weekend. You'll see that there's different events, places to explore, and of course the shopping and restaurants and details like that. So again, this is mytorontomeeting.com and you can also hear from them on Twitter. If you follow them, they are just see Toronto now. So if you check out at see Toronto now, you'll learn more all about visiting Toronto and while you're on Twitter it is impossible to ignore all of the tweets about the CMT Awards last night so I wanted to take a minute to show you all the different uh, celebrities that were posting from the CMT Awards last night John Legend was posting about it before he even got to Nashville and Luke Bryan posted a really fun picture he took with Jason Derulo who was making headlines last night and of course Carrie Underwood was a big winner last night and she posted a picture you'll notice that everyone who was there was using the hashtag CMT Awards and posting really fun pictures. So CMT, of course, themselves on their account has a lot of great pictures to check out from the awards. So make sure you check that out while you're on Twitter today. And now it is time to send it back out to the studio to see what Matt's working on.